Hello, Sarah here from smallbusinessair.com. And today I'm excited to tell you about a new bookkeeping solution that I have for you. So I work with a lot of Amazon sellers and Amazon is great because anyone can give it a shot. And there's a lot of people out there online explaining how to sell on Amazon, explaining retail arbitrage, explaining how to buy wholesale and sell at retail on Amazon. And Amazon can create a great way for anyone to start their own small business. So what happens when you start a small business is you have to start worrying about your bookkeeping because you need to know if you're profitable and you need to know your numbers in order to file your taxes at the end of the year. Sorry, even small business owners have to file tax return. So what I'm finding is a lot of people are trying Amazon. And I normally recommend using QuickBooks Online for your bookkeeping needs. I just, I love working with QuickBooks Online. But sometimes QuickBooks Online is actually a little more than a new seller needs. Um, it's somewhat expensive. It's another monthly fee when you're really trying to cut costs. And sometimes Amazon just doesn't stick. You give it a shot, you try it, but unfortunately sometimes people just can't manage to make it profitable or they're only a little bit profitable. And in that case, it doesn't make sense to spend a lot of time uh, learning a program like QuickBooks Online. It also doesn't make a lot of financial sense to invest the money into using QuickBooks Online with the monthly subscription fee. So I've created a spreadsheet product. This spreadsheet is going to be perfect for those newer Amazon sellers. You're just getting started, you're trying things out, um, and you're trying to save money where you can. This spreadsheet is also a great choice for the Amazon seller that hasn't taken the time yet to set up separate business financial accounts. You haven't set up a, a separate checking account or a separate credit card for your Amazon business. Now, don't get me wrong, that is best practices. And in the description, I'll provide some links for companies that I recommend when you're setting up your business checking and business credit card accounts. But when you first get started, sometimes you're mixing those business and personal transactions. And so this spreadsheet actually makes it easier to do your bookkeeping if you do have some of that mixing going on. Whereas a program like QuickBooks Online is a lot easier to use if you've already done the work of setting up separate checking accounts and credit cards for your business. So if you're just getting started and you have some mixing, this spreadsheet is gonna be great. It's also a great option for the Amazon seller that doesn't have a huge volume of outside transactions. So this spreadsheet will work regardless of how many sales you're making in Amazon because we're going to use a summary that we obtained from Amazon to complete um, our bookkeeping through this spreadsheet. And that summary is gonna give us all of our Amazon sales and fees information that we need. But as a business owner, you have other expenses. You're buying products that you're then reselling on Amazon, whether it's through retail arbitrage or whether you're buying wholesale and then reselling. So this spreadsheet is ideal for the business owner that doesn't have a huge volume of other expense transactions outside of Amazon. Once your volume of transactions starts to increase, then you might wanna consider looking at using a program like QuickBooks Online to do your Amazon bookkeeping. And I have a tutorial video on that, which you can find that video in the card in the upper right hand corner and also in the description. So let me tell you a little bit more about the spreadsheet product. It is easy to use, it's gonna be accurate. Um, it's going to be fast, and you're going to be able to tie to your 1099 at year end. Right now, this spreadsheet is in a Google Doc format, um, but I am hoping to expand it to Excel in the near future. So if you are a small business owner and you're just getting started, why even bother about bookkeeping? It's kind of a question I get a lot. Like, do I really need to worry about bookkeeping? But unfortunately, the answer is yes. Um, and there's several reasons. The first reason that most people think about is the IRS. You are going to get a 1099 from Amazon at the end of the year, and you need to have records that tie to that 1099 
and you need to have record of your other expenses as well so that you can accurately report everything to the IRS at the end of the year. And that is what this spreadsheet is gonna help you do. But more importantly than being ready come tax time, it's important to focus on your bookkeeping so that you know whether you are profitable or not. I can't tell you how many times I've started working with a new bookkeeping client. They think that they are profitable, but in fact, they are not. And it is really important to understand how your business is making money, where all of your cash flow is going in regard to expenses, and be able to look at that bottom line and know, am I making money or am I not making money? That is crucial. Knowing your numbers throughout the year is going to help you make better decisions for your business and become more profitable. And that is, of course, a good thing. And then, of course, when you outgrow this spreadsheet, I've got tutorial videos that can help you do your Amazon bookkeeping through QuickBooks Online. You can find this spreadsheet by going to my Etsy shop, smallbusinesssarah.etsy.com. And I will have a link in the description as well. I think you are going to be very surprised at how easy it is to use this spreadsheet and get your bookkeeping done easily and accurately each month. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments. And as always, I really appreciate your like and your subscribe. Have a great day.